Weather Service uh, personnel out surveying damage across the Midwest, including in and around Chicago. We understand an EF1 tornado uh, touched down, was in progress near Gary, Indiana. One storm tracker captured the tornado last uh, night on video. Uh, Paul Goddard joins us now on the phone. Uh, Paul, thanks so much uh, for joining us. Uh, we kind of describe where you were and what you saw as we take a look at your video. Absolutely, Chris. So I was uh, just in Munster, Indiana, about a, about a quarter mile away from my house, and I was watching the storms cross over the state line in Indiana. And I was thinking, you know, we're going to see some hail, and I'm going to capture some B-roll footage for, for, the, for the people that follow me locally here. And next thing you know, I shoot up a quarter mile down the road, I'm watching the hail, and a tornado warning gets issued. And I jump out my car to take a better look at the sky around me, and I notice it is coming right towards me, and I am pretty much centered in the hook of the tornado. And there's a nice big opening in the sky right above me, and the hook is coming around. You could barely start to see a funnel starting to form in Hammond, Indiana, as it worked its way northeast towards Gary. Uh, I watched the storm approximately five minutes as it went right above me, and then I started tracking it all the way to the shore of Lake Michigan uh, in between two steel mills where the tornado finally touched down. And, Paul, just watching this video, it's remarkable at just how much you can see at night. Uh, are those the city lights there on the horizon? I'm guessing, are you looking north? Well, where are you looking here that you're able to get such uh, well definition with the light and then there's the lightning? Kind of tell us a little bit about what you were seeing as you were videoing this. So the, the video of the actual tornado is going to be looking west towards Chicago, and it's going to have a little light pollution from Chicago back there, but it's, it's exactly in between two giant steel mills here in Gary, and it's all lit up along the lakeshore there, and it, it couldn't have been a better shot for the actual tornado crossing over into the lake. Have you seen anything like this before? Oh, yeah. This, this isn't my first tornado, but locally here in my, on my own home turf, this is the first for me. Is there anything else I haven't asked you you want to add? No, I, it's, it was just spectacular seeing it and, and amazing that it missed Hammond and Gary, Indiana. These are very heavy populated areas right there. And for it not to come down until it got right to by the shore, it's just a miracle. All right, Paul Goddard, thank you so much uh, for sharing that. Uh, and yes, uh, Jackie was such a heavily populated area, absolutely uh, fortunate that it, uh, it didn't do uh, something worse. Incredible.